Welcome back. You are live with Expresso and just in time for a vital discussion this morning. Now, I can speak from my own experience. Becoming a new parent is indeed a very stressful time that requires a lot of planning and preparation, far more than I ever imagined. Stress that can, of course, be augmented if your little one arrives prematurely. Now, World Prematurity Day, which is celebrated today, seeks to address institutional and educational constraints concerning the care and well-being of premature babies. And Julie Gibson, the coordinator of the Newborns Greta Skjør Trust, is joining us to tell us how we can help to ensure that more premature babies make it out of that critical stage alive and well. Julie, a very good morning. Welcome to the show. Thanks, um, I have to add to that one of the most incredible young human beings I know in the world, a little guy named Jordan, was born nearly a month premature, and he has grown into the most amazing young man, but he had incredible care and an unbelievable family. That's not the case, certainly here in South Africa, for everyone and globally. What are the current statistics at the moment? How, how prevalent is prematurity with, with, within babies? Graham, I think most people don't realise how many people are um, at risk of having a prematurely born baby. Globally, about 15 million babies are born prematurely every year. Wow. Um, that's about one every 30 seconds. Um, sure. And um, out of those, um, about one million don't survive. Oh, that is a shocking statistic, and we certainly empathise with parents going through that, um, that what must feel like a very individual journey, but there is help out there. There are ways that we can address this. What is World Prematurity Day all about? Certainly from your trust perspective, what are you aiming to achieve? Um, we reckon that if we can raise awareness about prematurity, about the associated risks with it, um, that we can help reduce the incidence of prematurity. Um, so that's what we're all about, and World Prematurity Day is the one day every year that we can say, stand up for our preemies, talk about it. It's something that people don't like to talk about because you don't want to think it could happen that's to you. That's terrifying, and I'm considering it here you know, as, we, as we speak, and it is something that is terrifying to, to embrace, and I think that makes it even more exclusionary. You, you kind of feel like you're going through this alone, but you're not. Uh, wh what can we do as South Africans to help support your efforts? Um, first thing is, um, raise funds for uh, neonatal units. Um, you can raise funds through the um, Newborns Trust. We have an annual fundraising campaign today, which is called Wear Purple for Preemies. Buy a 10 Rand sticker, Wear Purple, and um, shout out about preemies, talk about it. Um, let people know that they're not alone out there, they're not going through it alone. There are also a lot of neonatal units in the country that need things, um, hampers for moms, starter packs for babies, um, little garments, people can knit garments for the babies. So there's lots that the average man in the street can do. And educate yourself about pregnancy, healthy pregnancy, healthy baby. What do you think is that one major thing that's standing in our way? Why do we have such a high incidence of... of um, death with premature babies? Um, good question and difficult one to answer. Um, in a lot of cases, people don't know why um, babies are born too soon. That's the major problem. There are risks that are associated with the mom's health. Um, if a mom has problems like diabetes, heart problems, uh, problems with the pregnancy, those can all contribute to it. But in the majority of cases, there is not one, one factor that um, gives rise to prematurity. So all of us are at risk of giving birth to a premature baby. No, regardless of where you are in life, what your socioeconomic state it is, is um, we, we all are at risk. Um, but, and that being said, we are all standing together as well. So Julie, thank you so much for the efforts that you're putting in individually and your, your group. And, and we certainly wish you all the, the best of success today, especially. And we, we spend a, send a thought out to all of our parents that are currently in the throes of grappling with this at the moment. The gift of life is precious, but often very, very fragile. And if you'd like to help, you can get more information on where to purchase your purple 10 Rand sticker. 10 Rand, that's all it's going to cost you from newborns.org. Dot .za